Hey, what is going on guys, British Fusion here, and today I'm with you for another video, and today's video is an unboxing of WWE Elite Series 93, Seth freaking Rollins. Yes, I saw this in Smith's during the making of this video yesterday, and I just saw it and I was like, I must have this in my collection. I believe this is from his WrestleMania 38 attire, I believe. No, WrestleMania 37, actually, that's the one. Yeah, it's from that attire. I'm so happy to have this in my collection. Let's have a little look at the box. So right at the front, we do have the Seth Rollins figure itself with some interchangeable hands. And then on the side, it does say Seth Rollins. And then on the back is everybody that's in the series as well as Seth Rollins right there. So we do have Seth Rollins, T-Bar, Karrion Cross, Cesaro, Ricky Steamboat, and Raquel Gonzalez, obviously now known as Raquel Rodriguez. And then on the side, we do have another picture there of Seth Rollins. So let's waste no more time and get into this unboxing. Here he is outside of the box and it is insane. I'm so, so happy with it. So first off, we're gonna have a look at the interchangeable hands. So we do have the left and right hand, one of them with a glove one of them without. So I'm gonna leave them just on my iPad, just there in front of me. And then he is in his jacket, right here in his entrance jacket. And it is rubber, but the really cool thing about this one is, it's actually like loose enough to like pose him in whatever like sort of pose you want. You can't, like there is still some restrictions, but you can have him like that, or you can have him with his arms out just like that which is actually really cool. I'm really happy with Mattel that they've done something like that. So I think the best way to change out of his jacket is to take the hands off, just like so. I'll put them on my side just there. And then, yeah, you just pull them back and then the jacket should just slip off just like so. So yes, there is the jacket with all the Sephiroth's kind of detail on there, which is really, really cool. So let's put the hands back on because it looks very odd without the hands. I do have a second hand Triple H that's got like, no, like that's got the wrong hands, which is really weird. But anyway, I'm going off topic here. We are here for the Seth freaking Rollins just there. So he does have a laughing face sculpt right there with all of his design on his body as well as his tattoo right at the back. And then, like I said, he does have his glove on just one hand and then just a wrist tape on the other. And then for the attire, which is really, really nicely detailed, we do have some picture art of Seth Rollins just right there. And then on his other leg, we do have his logo that he usually has ever since he like became a singles competitor, basically. But yeah, that is really it. That is the unboxing of Seth freaking Rollins. I'm so happy with it. I'm so glad he's in my collection. I cannot wait to possibly display him up in my figure cabinet. And I'm, yeah, if you haven't got it, make sure that you do. Make sure that you try to get it in your collection if you can find him. And overall, I'll probably give this figure a good eight out of 10. I think it's a very, very solid figure. But yes, guys, if you did like it, please make sure that you do smash that like button. And if you haven't already, please make sure that you do subscribe. And also make sure you do check out the playlist link down in the description below for all of my other figure unboxings. But yes, I've been British Fusion. I really do hope you like this video. Leave a comment and subscribe for more. Peace out, guys.